Bill Haney, father of Devin Haney, stated recently in an interview that Devin Haney, his son, is the boogeyman at the 135 pound division. No one calls him out. Devin also stated, I am that boogeyman. No one calls me out. What's happening, everyone? I am your host, Nice, and welcome back to the fight room. If you're not a subscriber, make sure you do for the latest boxing news, feedback, and entertainment. So recently, Bill Haney had an interview, I think it was with the Boxing Voice or another YouTube platform, and he stated that Devin Haney is that monster, that nightmare in the closet at the 135 pound for every fighter. In other words, they fear him. They don't call him out. Sort of true. You know, I stated once, and I'm gonna state it again, Devin Haney is the boogeyman for Ryan Garcia. Now, I never stated that he was the monster at the 135 pound division. I said that he was the monster for Ryan Garcia. Now, Ryan Garcia had stated that he wants to fight every 135 pounder and he wants to save Devin Haney for last. Reason being, I stated it before and I'm gonna state it again. They fought six times in the amateurs and he fears Devin Haney in some way. You know, it was a bad experience for him fighting Devin Haney and he doesn't want to go through that nightmare once again. So he's preparing himself and making sure that he is well prepped before he faces his Goliath, his monster, his nightmare in his closet, have you? Now, it is the truth. People don't understand, man. Haney is a monster, a sharp technician that hardly could be touched. And he is a problem for Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia is getting better. I have said it once, twice, a million times he is. But to me, he is not ready for Devin Haney. Devin Haney is just too much as far as boxing skills go. Moves around, his lateral movement is great. Footwork, speed, you know, his hands, combinations, you name it, he has it. Ryan Garcia is afraid of Devin Haney. Now, I don't care what nobody says. I'm not saying that he's scared, you know, scared, scared of him, but he's afraid of that memory to come back and haunt him once again. So he's making sure that doesn't happen. And he wants to fight every other 135 pounder first. He believes he can beat those guys. So, you know, he wants to fight Gervonta. And he stated that De Devin Haney should fight Tiafimo Lopez. So with that being said, we should know, you guys should know, and everyone should know that Ryan Garcia has been avoiding Devin Haney. Yes. Now, Devin is the WBC champ. Now, we know that Loma had that title and it was handed down to him. He did not want that hand down, but he took it. And now he's suffering the consequences thereof. Because now it's like, where does he stand in the 135 pound division? He's being avoided. So where does he stand? You know, the WBC should mandate mandatories. They should just stick with the mandatory and, and make things happen. You know, he should fight Tiafimo. And Tiafimo just stated that he sent the contract. But as far as Bill Haney's concerned, he said he hasn't because he is the promoter. Devin Haney is his own promoter and they haven't had that call yet. During the Boxing Voice, I believe, he had an interview with the Boxing Voice and during the interview, he had a text stating that Tiafimo Lopez was undergoing the negotiations at that moment for the Cambosis Jr. fight. So now he's thinking about calling Javier Fortuna. Now Javier Fortuna is a good, pretty good fighter. He's the next one for Devin Haney, unfortunately, because he is the avoided fighter. So yeah, he is an avoided boogeyman for Ryan. But Devin Haney, excuse me, Tiafimo, hasn't called him out like he should call him out in times past. But now he is. Hopefully they can make that happen after the Cambosis fight because I believe that Tiafimo is going to give Cambosis that shot and they're going to mandate that. They're going to make sure that Cambosis get that shot. And Cambosis is not going to take... A, a, a step aside money for that I doubt that because he really wants that fight so it's gonna get made 
And then we're going to see what happens with Devin Haney. He's going to have to probably fight Javier Fortuna. So stay in tune for that. But as far as the Bill Haney interview, he also stated and said that he respects Ryan Garcia and his team for being very honest and saying that they're going to take Devin Haney last. And they know why. He said, I respect him for that. He respects his team and respects Ryan Garcia more than any other 135 pounder in the division right now because he spoke the truth. He wants Devin Haney last because he's not ready for Devin Haney. That's what Ryan Garcia said and therefore Bill Haney respects him even more for that. So guys, do your homework. Make sure y'all know what's going on. Y'all already know I am your host, Nice. Like, comment, subscribe. Most of all, don't forget to share the fight room.